What's up everybody? Kind of a different format of this vlog this week. A lot of people have requested over the last couple of years for me to do more behind the scenes or process videos. So that's what this video is gonna be, is strictly a behind the scenes process video. I did a time lapse of a recent painting and uh, and then I'm gonna create a, um, a voiceover kind of explaining what I'm gonna do. So let me know in the comments below if you like this style. Thanks for checking it out. And also make sure you check out the link below to Stroke NJ. It's a new um, artist collective that I'm partnering with. I'm really excited to see uh, what we can accomplish here with uh, with the arts in South Jersey. So looking forward to that as well. So hope you enjoy and like I said let me know in the comments below uh, what you think of this new format. So this would be painting probably 55 of my 100 Days of Summer series. Um, I'm challenging myself this summer to learn how to paint in oil. Um, I usually always paint in uh, latex house paint actually. Uh, so I was challenging myself to learn oils so I gave myself a challenge of painting a hundred paintings in a hundred days all revolving around the theme of summer it's been a lot of fun learning the oils I think people often a lot of times when people learn to start with like acrylics or watercolors oils can be really intimidating and they were for me but I really enjoy the, the mixing process you can see there it's my limited palette as well I've been working just really simply with just white, red, yellow, blue, and uh, and brown. I think it's a raw umber. And that simple palette has allowed me just to kind of focus on uh, technique and focus on just mixing color and seeing color and not be so intimidated by a whole palette full of different options. So at this point of the painting, I'm adding her hips back in to this lady. It's one thing I like about the, the oils is it's, you kind of mold it and manipulate it. I think the biggest challenge for this summer series is uh, a lot of the paintings I've done are people on the beach and mixing color that trying to get in the right sand color and trying to get this tan skin tone color and getting those to contrast that's been a, a real challenge for me I feel like I always this this painting the person's body is a little browner than I would have liked I'm actually go and kind of fix that later but uh, and then blonde hair on the beach that was a bit of a challenge as well I think, I think it turned out okay at this point of painting I wish I would have stopped the sky right there but um, just kind of overplayed it and I think leaving that background under painting would have would have looked really cool when I was rewatching it I was like oh I wish I would have left it like that at this point I'm just kind of putzing around with the painting um, maybe I should have left it be but I was trying to decide what color to paint the bikini top and bottom so while I was thinking I was just trying to kind of playing around with all these paintings I give myself a one hour time limit so I don't overwork it and overplay with it and just uh, force myself to make quick decisions so uh, so that's what was going on at that point and uh, this is kind of the finished product Hope you guys enjoyed that behind the scenes video. Let me know in the comments below if that's something that you enjoyed or if there's other things about the vlogs that you like. Hope you guys have a great weekend and I'll see you next Friday. Thanks.